23-year-old teacher in Colorado by the name of Carly McKinney, who has been suspended because of the fact that she was on Twitter tweeting about how she was uh, naked, wet, and stoned. That doesn't sound too okay. bad. First of all, a 23-year-old math teacher, which kind of amazes me, right? Like, so, okay, that, that makes sense. Maybe if you are very driven, you know, I started my career when I was young, so if you're driven, motivated, it's possible. But uh, there she is, she's the math teacher for this uh, school, and um, it's Overland High School in Aurora, Colorado, to be specific. Anyway, and she tweets these pictures. She's smoking pot there. She was allegedly smoking oh. pot on <laughs> okay, the school right. grounds. <laughs> All right, all right. So the, there was a couple of pictures that were no big deal, right? All right, smoking pot, blah, blah, and then she's hanging literally upside down. And then we're seeing nip action, we're seeing no bra, you know, okay. Now look, the thing- But where you, were the parents, Jake? That's <laughs> what I want to know. <laughs> the parents? They were on Twitter checking these pictures out. <laughs> okay. So now look, here's the thing. It's a free country. She can hang upside down and show us her uh, panties, and nicely done, by the way. Uh, and by the way, it's in Colorado, smoking pot is perfectly legal, okay? At the moment, and I hope it stays that way, okay, but, so but you can't smoke pot on the school grounds. School I mean, grounds is a bit of a problem. Yes. Uh, when she admitted there was a, a drug raid, at when she tweets out... Let me read you that tweet, actually. This, this is great. Yeah, okay. Uh, she tweeted that, uh, watching a drug bus go down in the parking lot, it's funny because I have weed in my car in the staff parking lot. Yeah, that's funny, except you just made that public. Yeah, she, she made that public. There were other tweets, for instance, as I, uh, you know, I referred to this earlier. Uh, naked, wet, stoned. That was one of her tweets. Mm -hmm. Another one was, such an easy day. Can't wait to roll up after school. <laughs> Listen, I'm all for rolling up after school, right? Not, not personally. Don't okay, get me no, wrong. no, of course not. <laughs> but I'm, you probably <laughs> should make this stuff public. So the reason why this I think story that a broke. Lot of the People probably wanted to roll that up after school. All right, let's calm down. <laughs> so the reason why this story broke is because, you know, thankfully we have local news. Uh, Nine News in Colorado found this Twitter account and they thought, you know what, maybe this is actually a trick on this 23-year-old student. Let's give her a call and figure out what's happening. And now you get a sense of how intelligent this woman really is. Hi, Carly. Um, when I first I, uh, called 23-year-old math teacher Carly McKinney, I thought she may have been the victim of a cruel prank. You're making up the stuff about the marijuana? McKinney answered, I didn't do that. So are you in control of this Twitter account or are you not? McKinney's reply, I was, but I guess I'm not. Although the last <laughs> public post on the Carly Crunk Bear site was, local news station just called me, tweaking out. <laughs> That's so dumb. That's so dumb. Why would you kind of deny it on air and then immediately confirm it on your Twitter account, which they just told you they were watching and reading? God, man, she should be fired on that alone. I don't want her anywhere near math. Imagine how badly she bungles the math. Math is her thing. That's her thing. Oh, yeah. That's hey, guys, people. should we pardon her unnecessarily? Look, hey, look. Knowing Jank, he would pardon her. No, look, marijuana's legal. Uh, butt shots are legal. Okay. <laughs> Twitter's legal. Can I, can I get a pardon, J.R. and Asus? Well, the thing is, you know, I mean, it's, you have some skill. You can teach some people. Maybe she's good at gymnastics. Make her a gym, a gym teacher. It, it, she's flexible. Uh, Asus, can I get a pardon? <laughs> yes, you get social media, start teaching them what not to do on social media. Yeah, no, you know what? Take a week off, learn from this, put away your Twitter account, okay? And, uh, and then welcome back to school. What do you think, Anna? Well, I, I, I don't want to be a hypocrite on this situation. We've done stories in the past where a female teacher has uh, nude photos of herself on, online, and then she gets fired, which I think is absolutely ridiculous. I don't think that she should get suspended based on the pictures alone. I think that she should get suspended for her utter disregard and, uh, and just complete like lack of intelligence. <laughs> because I, I, Disregard for general common sense. Common sense, exactly, yeah. Okay, so look, I, I'm a little torn. I, I, I don't want to fire her. I, maybe I'm being softy, you know, putting the kidding aside, you know, because again, nothing she did is illegal. She, you know, one of the girl, uh, kids in school says, hey, uh, McCutie, and she says, oh, you're being jailbait, and you're jailbait, I'm there. They said, so like, these are all a little unacceptable, but I don't think anything necessarily crossed the line, but I, I would, I would sit her down. The only and I'd be like, listen, man, you got to straighten this thing out 
ASAP. The only thing that makes me lean toward firing her, and there, there has to be proof of this, um, there is an indication that she was smoking on school grounds. If she's really doing that, then yes, yeah, she should be fired. You can't, you can't show up to work drunk. You can't be drinking at work unless you work at TYT. So, um, so you can't, like on a school campus, you can't do that. So if she gets caught doing that and there's evidence of it, then yes, she should get fired. Fair enough. Pardon her. If she were an Throw unattractive, if she were an unattractive female, I guarantee you that Jenk would be like off with her head. <laughs> you know, what do you take me for? You take me for a Neanderthal conservative? Sometimes. No, absolutely not. No, her level of attractiveness while she was hanging upside down had nothing to do with my judgment whatsoever. <laughs>